Um, the stadium uh, has changed. I like, it's beautiful. Um, something that I like, you know I, I would love to play with, uh, in the practice field over there. That's, that's, that's another beautiful thing, and I, I would love to practice in there. So, the weight room, um, most likely everything here, because um, I've been back ever since uh, 07, and things completely changed now. Oh, it's beautiful. Um, Dan McCurney deserved every award like that he get, and um, for him like to get that to the Hall of Fame, that's that's something like you no know, he done ever since he got here at '95, and until he left 2000, what seven six. Two out of six, so like, man, he deserved every moment of it. I remember, like, mostly every time I touched the ball, I'm, I was breaking 20 to 30 yards a, a carry. So um, for me, uh, to rush for that 378 yards, I got to give, um, I got to give, like, you no, know, my offensive lineman, like, you know, the best thing, like, you know, they ever did. Like, you know, I, well, I told him after the game, um, this is the, the best game I ever had, and this is the best blocking y'all ever did for me. I thought it was a joke, cause. Um, one of the reporters called me. Um, I, I forgot the name. Told him. he called and said, uh, "Troy, you know that you got um, that to the Hall of Fame." I said, um, "When does the ballots come out?" He said, "No, Troy, you're in there." And I just dropped the phone and just looked up and said, "Thank God!" And I finally made it. And, and that's a blessing. Uh, that's one of my goals, and that was one of my dreams to like you know, to get in the Hall of Fame, and I did it.